the company next door to Samuel Williams Main Gate had a big water tower and it must have been two or three hundred foot high. And sitting on top of that water tower was a little hut and it was our foreman. He'd have to climb that 300 foot every morning to go to work but he could see every single corner of the job. Now if you was getting up to mischief you knew exactly where you could be out of sight of Odgy. If you had nothing to do you would creep away and go behind the back of the coal banks and hide up so that Odgy couldn't see that you were stationary. Uh, but he could virtually see everything and the amount of people that were stealing, he could see what was going on in every corner of the dock and he used to put them all away and he would even put the loco boys away if he got the chance. We knew he was a bit of a tough lad. But he had an old fold car, an old, and I'm sure it was a T model. And he used to draw in of a morning, park it virtually under this hut. And if it had been raining, he would wipe the whole car down before he climbed up all them ladders. He'd come back down of a night and he'd wipe that car off again. And they tell me that he wiped it off when he got to the garage at home in Raynham. <laughs> but he was, he was in charge of us.